He's Michael Moore, America's favorite whistleblower. The man in everyone's face. The guy asking the question, are we a nation of gun nuts or just plain nuts? My name was second highest on the bomb threat list. Which kind of made me mad. Why? Because you didn't make it the number one? It would have been kind of like an ego thing there, you know, knowing that I was number one at something. I love my gun. Loves my gun. I'm here to open up an account. Okay, what type of account? I want the account where I can get the free gun. You do a CD no, and we'll hand you a gun. Well, here's my first question. Do you think it's a little dangerous handing out guns in a bank? Now, he's taking aim at America's most controversial subject. Why do you think we have so many gun murders in America? Because everybody's first reaction is pull the gun out. The town of Virgin, Utah, has passed a law requiring all residents to own guns. This is a great place to raise your children. There has been a terrible shooting. After Columbine, no one could figure out why the boys had resorted to violence. Why would kids do this? You don't think kids say dad goes off to the factory every day. He built missiles. What's the difference between that and the mass destruction of Columbine High School? I guess I don't see that connection. United Artists presents the sensation of the 2002 Cannes Film Festival and the only film to win a unanimous jury prize. And then Moses himself showed up. From my cold, dead hands. Ten days after the Columbine killing, Charlton Heston came to Denver and held a large pro-gun rally. How could the NRA come here? To me, it's like they're rubbing their nose in. Mr. Heston, I'm a member of the NRA. I was wondering if maybe I could talk to you about the whole gun issue. Critics are calling it scathing, incendiary, hilarious, and provocative. Our children had turned into little monsters. But who was to blame? What were the suspects doing the morning of attack? I heard that they were bowling. <laughs> Bowling for Columbine. Why wasn't anyone blaming bowling for warping their minds? A movie that will have you up in arms. Thank you for not shooting me. 